So today I'm taking a trip to Kamakura Shrine. Let's go! Kamikura Shrine is located here in Shingu. When you first get to the location of Kamikura Shrine, there's a bridge that allows you to get over into the shrine. When you first walk in, it's a flat level area where there's many different spots to look at. Of course, what attracts most people's attention is the giant tori over to the left side. The stairs going up to the top was a lot steeper than I thought it would be. At first, climbing up was not even a task. It was actually quite easy. But as I slowly kept going up and up, I realized that it was actually a very, very long path. This would not be a path that I would suggest for someone who either has leg issues or gets winded extremely easy. I was actually getting winded probably about halfway up. I was breathing heavy. There's two spots that are flat that allows you to sit there and take a break uh, before continuing up the steps. Once you reach the top of the stairway, there's a mini tori that you have to pass through and go to the main part of the shrine. Just about every shrine I've seen has these purification, uh, I don't know what you want to call them, uh, water thingy mabobblers. Basically what you have to do is you walk up to it, you grab the ladle that's there, you pick up water, you wash off your left hand, switch hands, wash off your right, and then drink of the water. If you're going to drink of it, I suggest reaching across and getting fresh water flowing into it. I do not suggest using the water inside the, the tray. And what this is, this is purifying your hand and inside your mouth as well. When you're done with the purification, you walk up towards the main part of the shrine. There's an excellent spot where you can get a great view of Shingu. So there's this nice shrine on top of this climb. When you walk up, you put your money in the tray. You reach out and you grab the rope with the bell attached to it and you shake it. Then you're going to bow twice, clap twice, and then bow again. There are different variants to that same idea, but that is the most standard and traditional way to do it. Once you're done, you walk back down. Climbing back down, I thought, was a lot harder than climbing up. Even though you're going downhill, it's fine. But when you get closer to the beginning, it was a very, very steep hill. When I had my feet down on one of the lower ends, three or four stairs up, I was holding the rocks with my hands. They do have a bucket with walking sticks to help you climb up and down. I didn't grab one and I saw a lot of other people were grabbing them. Uh, next time I climb up there, I'm probably going to grab one to see exactly how well that works. I very much enjoyed the shrine. I thought it was extremely beautiful. If there's anything that you guys would like me to capture next time or look at in more detail, please leave it in the comments below. Uh, and don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe to my videos.